think it's clear that science has lost ground in the education system over the last several decades. We're trying to reverse that by putting on a science conference, science, technology, engineering and math that will appeal to people of all ages and all backgrounds. Now science, technology, engineering and mathematics, these are critical areas. Now you go anywhere today, anything, even anyone who's watching this recording, it is steeped in technology and science. The world we live in today, you can't take a breath without some aspect of science being a part of everyone's life. And whether it's simply for literacy or whatever it is, we need people to understand the values of it. And that's why we need to push it. You'll find that the areas of um, jobs and so on in the next decade are going to be greatly in these areas. So in the Caribbean, science and maths has been a little bit on the downslide. And a conference like this really gives it an impetus. And that's part of it. And you will find that. I mean, we've just been amazed. You could normally have a coloring contest and kids are coloring Winnie the Pooh. But here they were coloring a telescope. And right there, you'll have kids wondering what's a telescope and learning about it. So definitely a great one for the Caribbean and I am expecting to see other great things come out of this already. After we decided to build the observatory, a group of us wanted to do something to stimulate interest in science among not only our students and teachers but the general public and so we thought perhaps the best way to do that would be to host a con conference that would take in as many aspects of science as possible so that whatever interest people had in science their interest could be whetted somewhat at the conference. And there'll be a host of things dealing with math education in the schools, uh, dealing with cloud computing. We have Microsoft delivering a talk. Uh, we're having a talk on um, the science of brewing, if you can imagine, because there is science involved in that too. And it is so exciting that a short six months later, and with a lot of support from teachers and other people at UCCI, that this has come to fruition today. Science is important in the development of our society and the development of the world. And so we should have a renewed focus on science teaching and the learning of science, beginning from the primary school right on up through university and throughout life. <laughs>